So I have most of the engine put together. Uh, everything went together easy. My, my only complaint is the uh, some of the parts are very small and with my big old fat fingers I'm having a little bit of trouble getting things aligned properly but with a little um, patience and perseverance and it's coming along good. So after the engine is built I'll let that dry and then I will decide on a color for the body and continue on. Well, there it is folks, Myers Manx. I built it as the street version and I gotta tell you it was an absolute pleasure to put this together. The most difficult part, oddly enough, was applying the decals. They just would not lay down proper and they're still drying right now as I speak. But uh, eventually they'll settle down and uh, everything will come out nice. I absolutely had a blast building it. One of my favorite things was that little extra artwork. If you see the unboxing, you, you see all about this. I thought that was really cool. Be nice to hang up in a 8x10 picture frame and put it on the wall in your model room. But the kit itself, like I said, was a blast. You, you had your option of building it three different ways. Um, and I, I chose the street version. And it's uh, pretty cool. I want to thank my good buddy Tim as he uh, he got this kit for me and, uh, and that's it folks uh, there's the Myers Manx by uh, AMT 125 scale kit kit number AMT 1320-12 alright I hope you all have a great day thanks for stopping by and we'll see you on the next one keep on modeling